boat. Can you hear me? Help. I got you, man. Help. I am 911. I've got an incredible video to share with you folks today that a viewer actually shared with me. And so maybe some of you have seen this already, but it just goes uh, great with the, the subject matter of my channel in general, which is tractor safety. And while this is actually a zero turn mower, the same thing could easily happen on a tractor. And this uh, gentleman was mowing around a pond and fell in and fortunately, miraculously, was able to be saved. This oftentimes does not end this way in these situations. So let's watch the video and then talk about it. Recording. Hey, 41 is 23. You, man. Okay, hang on, man. Okay, hang on. I am 911. All right, so a uh, Kendall County Sheriff's Department is uh, where this video was posted on YouTube at, and Unfortunately, it only has 880 views. I mean, this is the kind of thing that should go viral. I mean, for everybody in the tractor world, commercial lawnmowers and landscapers out there, if you're working around ponds, these situations are just, I mean, it's, they can be over in the blink of an eye. So this gentleman, common situation, mowing on a steep bank, right? And zero turns being two wheel drive, especially there's, it's even easier to lose, to lose traction and slip over. And as you can see that zero turn flipped over on him. Really incredible footage though. Fortunately, it was a shallow entry into the pond and uh, shallow water there. This gentleman's head was able to stay above water. Okay. Good. Watch your hand here, boy. That's hot. Your exhaust is hot. I got it. I'm okay. You're telling me? That thing got slippery. It got away on me. What's your name? Thanks, boys. Get out of here. Come on. Get out of here. Pretty incredible there how that guy was able to make it out alive. That does not happen. You know, we did a video this past summer, too. Um, just highlighting a lot of folks that had basically a, a shock video, right? Because I, I, there's so many new tractor owners out there. I mean, raise your hand if you're a new tractor owner because they're on our channel all the time trying to learn how to use a tractor. But the component that's missing is how to use it safely. And around ponds, on hillsides, the same kind of thing can happen, right? When you're, if you're sideways like this gentleman was, which I don't know how else you mow around a pond like that on a zero turn, you kind of got to go sideways but you can lose traction, you can hit, you know, oftentimes the, the pond banks will kind of give way, right? So they're uneven and they're losing material. So you could get into a, a pothole, so to speak, and, and tip over that way. But, you know, if you're, if you're on your operator station, you have your roll bar up, that prevents you from rolling the whole way over. But if you have your roll bar up, then the instructions typically tell you to put your seatbelt on as well. So then you're, you're trapped in there. And if you go into a pond, well, then you're struggling trying to find where the where the release is and get out of there. Uh, if you're in a cab, that can be dangerous as well. There were some folks uh, that slid into a pond and they got their clothes snagged around, other things on their loose clothing and were not able to get out. And they, they found them just with the, the, the clothing snagged on uh, parts of their tractor as well. So some serious dangers. You always wanna be aware when you're on your tractor, when you're on your zero turn anyways, but you should have a, a real plan in place on how to try to escape that. And, I don't know what else this gentleman could have done. You know, these things happen in the blink of an eye. And he was just very fortunate to be able to be in a shallow part of that pond where he could keep his head above water uh, until the paramedics got there. And that fortunately somebody heard him too, because that oftentimes is not the case. So this is one of the best videos I've seen out there. And one of the best because of the fact that it ends with a, you know, a, a happy ending, right? So the, the 
the person survived it, they recovered and, and they're good to go. It could have been a tragic ending for uh, many folks out there, but it's just to raise the awareness, I would share this video or go to that original video and share that one. I'm not looking to um, necessarily gain from this other than trying to spread the message of safety out there with zero turns, with uh, even ATVs and UTVs, you know, with your tractors, with your lawnmowers, all that stuff. Um, ponds, hillsides, there's safe ways to go about it. If you can on hills, drive up and down, not sideways along them because that's just asking for a rollover situation to happen. Keep your center of gravity low. That's why we're, why we're sponsored by RimGuard is because it goes inside your tires. It keeps, helps keep you planted to the ground. You know, add wheel weights on, carry your loads low with your front end loaders. Go slow, no need to go fast when you're in those precarious situations. And that's how you get home safe that night and get to go out and do it another day. So for those of you watching that do own a tractor and need more ballast weight, well, we sell ballast weight packages on our website and we ship them nationwide too. You can find what you need there at goodworkstractors.com. And if you're looking for something for your front end loader or a tool for your three point hitch, we can certainly help you out. We'd love to earn your business. I wanna thank you for taking time out of your day to stop by. And until next time, stay safe. We'll see you soon.